The next biggest engineering feat of keeping the deer out of your garden is building your gates. One of the main tips that I would tell you, no matter how you're building your gate, always put a cross member across the top. Because putting a cross member across the top is going to give this structural integrity. I'm sure you've seen the gates where they lean and sag um, all over people's fences. So there's no reason not to put the cross member on top as it'll just hold it in one place. And then also, if you want to grow trellises and nice things around it, it uh, makes that an option. The last thing to think about when you're installing your gates is human error. You know, th there's going to come a point when you or somebody else forgets to close the deer and the deer just come in. So I would recommend, I, I have, haven't installed this yet, but putting in a self-closing hinge, a spring-loaded hinge on your gate. And then also adding a latch that if you just push it closed, it'll automatically close like a very common gate latch.